Hello gang, what do you think? I forget you? No, 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 we are here. We are here to give you the crystals I told you four days before and I know it's the last day of uh, uh, Black Friday, but still, if you contact me really fast, you can take the deals. It's a couple of hours before the daily reset. And what we are seeing here, it's Polaris. Polaris magnetizing through her hands some things into the beats. Uh, I, I'm not sure how this is uh, December uh, relative, you know, it looks like summer, but uh, yeah, cool, cool. She feels like uh, she controls magnetism, so we are totally sure that we're going to get a mutant update. She is uh, daughter of Magneto. So she got herself magnetic uh, powers and we are 100% now that we're gonna get that. Uh, it's in the sneak peek in the game. In the update they dropped, they told us that as uh, a hint into the patch notes for the alliance things and stuff we get. Uru, a sale I think. Uh, but the main event of this video is roasting the winners of the crystal coupon giveaway and do another coupon giveaway back to back for you. So in one week from now, you can get the update with uh, some coupons and have crystals. Uh, the winners on this video are going to be three. And let's go through the names. The first winner of the giveaway is Anirudh. Uh, dot v dot n and his IGN is Anirud Vital and I, he's planning to buy Emma Frost Adam Warlock for Black Friday. Uh, this kind of uh, deals, it's the best one because you're getting half the price and you also get the achievement for Adam Warlock and get a refund back for crystals. I think I answered him to comment also i don't have the answer here but congratulations you just won some crystals and a roasting in a while so yeah, let's go to the second winner okay this is not the winner uh, the second winner is cross network and congratulations to the winners the previous because i'm crazy i went back to back to crystal coupon giveaway uh, videos and in the previous was the winners also so yeah Ross, my account, please. Yeah, you, that's why we are here, bro. You're a yum 1438007. And that's the second winner. Congratulations. Contact me through the description down below. There is a lot of social media. You can contact me. And Mert Gaming. I have changed my plan and have now bought World Boss Legend for the future investment. If I could get crystals for uniforms, I would appreciate very much. Thank you for your time. I hope you're gonna contact me really fast uh, because it's like three to four hours after I drop this video. So I'm gonna try to tag you also in the forum or anyone, all of you guys. So yeah, let's go through the raw things. Anirud Vital, it's the first one, but before we go through that, guys, I want you to make sure that you have subscribed to the channel, smash the like button, and comment down below in the comments your IGN and what did you bought during Black Friday. Exactly, if you bought like three uniforms, five uniforms, whatever uniforms, and also uh, to participate into the giveaway, I want you to follow five steps like like, subscribe, comment, go to my TikTok, like it. If your country don't uh, have a TikTok, there's no problem. Just tell me, let me know so I can conclude you into the giveaway. And that's the four steps. I said five, but yeah, I'm gonna make it clear down below in the description. Follow everything I'm gonna tell you. I need only your IGN, not your email. I just want to roast you. Don't need an email. Contact me through the Facebook or other social medias to give you the code as I'm always doing. So let's go to Mr. Vidal here. And his card looks dope. Uh, I mean, yeah. Of course, you got a free-to-play card, it's Loki, which is one of the best, but uh, still, the others are really cool. Feels like you took some peers this Black Friday, it's like two, four, six, seven, eight. Eight peers, yeah. 
uh, the roles here I'm not gonna discuss about the roles because they are feels you know uh, you, you need something and you get something and you let it and it's cool uh, I'm gonna plan for if I was you I would uh, swap Loki with Luna and Fox eventually with infinity card here uh, the new Avengers uh, except if you're planning to go through PvP more, then this is one of the best cards and other cards you could get is like Black Widow, but yeah. Uh, let's see. Cooldown 50%. Okay, there is a lot of cooldown there. You're already capped on all of your characters. You don't need any option on your uniform, so that's cool. That's cool. 46 ignore defense, it's cool also. 8% pierce, it's a base to start. But you need more, you know that. 52% max HP is a lot. That means a lot of your cards are rolled with max HP. You were liking that. And 73 all attack combined with 20% physical that give you 93 in total physical and 85 in energy. So it's kind of low, but with 20% on both more, you could go into another level, you know, if you have more than 100, 110, your account signs in ABX, ABL and all this stuff. But this is a really good start here and yeah, you're, you're really cool. Let's see your choices with the tier 4s. And yes, you have done the same as me, except Carnage. You have done Hulk, uh, which used to be a hybrid, but now it's uh, PvP. PvP uh, meta character that, uh, okay, you got his own artifact, double HP, okay, you know what you're doing, you know what you're doing, binary power, I would pro I would prefer protect the captain to stay more alive with all defense instead of this bubble of HP, but uh, yeah, you know, I, I guess you know it already, the rest of the build feels cool, uh, okay, uh, this is pretty garbage. I mean, pure level is giving you only against um, players. The pure level tag is only for characters that are controlled by players. The world boss legend has no tags like that. I have an email on my Discord if you want to join and read it from Netmarble telling me that. And here is just a proc, but yeah, I, may, I mean. You tier 4 your character and you didn't give him the max uh, weapon, which is custom gear. I mean, he needs a rage, bro. He needs a rage to sign. He is one of the best DPS in the game. He works with proc also, but you're missing a lot from him. He can be way better with a rage. Uh, your Thor from the other side got a judgment, which is really nice. I mean, it's the second best after... Uh, Okay, what is this thing? You don't really need to be uh, order, you just need to have like something like critical rate or critical damage to get any value and if you plan to mighty this, you want a concentration one because critical defense means nothing for PV and you have built him for PV as it seems. Um, and also your Iron Man, I didn't saw that. Uh, yeah, I saw that. I already roasted you on that. Yeah, the rest of the builds feels cool. Namor with a proc. Okay, good luck with that. It's really hard, but still, it's a paywall character, and you didn't even put the effort to put some Urus and build your ISO. I mean, this is your best character for combat villain. There's no way you have better. Yeah, I, I bet right. So build him. You don't have Carnage, you don't have anything on Iron. Build him, he wanted judgment or rage and critical damage, not decrease, increase, critical damage or critical rate. And the rest of the build, it's it's like you, you bought the uniform, you built him, tier 3, level 80 and drop him like that. I mean, he gonna bring the fish and eat you bro. What are you doing here? Build him more. Captain America works really nice with the proc, but still he needs some build also. I mean, yeah, that's the that's the proper that's the one proper artifact here for PV. Uh, but the rest of the build, it's like you dropped him also. What's gonna uh, what America gonna say if you have Captain America like that? You have you have to remember that everyone's showing your Captain America 
to see what kind of person are you. <laughs> Build your Captain America. I mean, yeah, he's cool, but you have already built it, your Venom, but you have no CTP and Venom works only with raids. So your, the main problem of your account, as it seems, it's CTPs. The struggle is real, I know. Uh, you saw me gambling on uh, my crystals uh, and getting zero CTPs. Well, it was Black Friday. I hope you didn't. But yeah, you need a lot of CTPs, bro. And yes, this proc, at least you know what you're doing. You're dropping proking damage, obelisks. This is critical damage decrease. You want to swap that too. And yes, let's go fast forward through your ABX. You need a raid here, bro. Okay, and you don't have any spare raids. It's not like you have dropped them in your account and forget them, but uh, you miss them literally. Black Bolt from the other side, he works really nice with an obelisk. If you bought his uniform, go through level 8 him. He gonna smash. He gonna smash on your account. He's one of the best, even tier 4 or tier 3. He's really cool, bro. Um, yeah, a hybrid build on Spider-Man, I guess. It, he's working with manual play or else you're dead. A, you want a regen or a better build for Spider-Man or else, yeah. You can't really, only on manual you can do kills with that build. Hela also, no artifacts. Okay, you're struggling again, I'm calling it. You're struggling on uh, PvP and PV because you don't have um, CDPs. Uh, but yes, you have choose to give the CDPs on proper characters as it seems. Sarah Rogers is the only one I saw that it see is kind of basically she's totally outdated you have six star this artifact i want that so badly bro what i guess level 50 gore could work on your account give him a gbi broken guard break immunity obelisk and he gonna do miracles for you even at level 50 but build him a bit more bro he deserves it uh, super giant, yeah, mind damage, guard break immunity, no Urus. Why, bro? Why no Urus? Well, uh, you don't believe in Urus? You, uh, you have another, uh, your your inner uh, your inner self telling you not to equip Urus for some reason. What are you, are you vegetarian also of Uru? What is this? What is this, bro? Okay, okay. I, I can tell you that you miss a bunch of CDPs and I'm sure for that but the choices on uniforms and the characters you have take and build it's really you have like a lot of a lot of support you have built the right characters for ABX and ABL and you have a great future if you focus on getting perhaps some legendary battles legendary battles giveaway really nice rages out there there is like three to four to get a rage uh but yeah, yeah you you want to get them eventually uh because yeah as it seems you took emma and you didn't took adam from yeah you skipped adam but yeah adam was uh, an idea a better idea because he's gonna get something for guardians of the galaxy emma we're not 100 percent sure Taskmaster could be your next build up and yes, the rest of your account it's pretty solid you want to focus on building more supports like Taskmaster, like Fox Oh, you bought him! Ooh, choo choo, Adam Warlock Yeah, bro, he totally deserves it, bro Nice Nice choice there and the rest is supports that you're missing. Uh, yeah, Ghost Panther, you want to tier 2 this too eventually. Because they give you a lot on ABX. But yeah, you have done really nice job here, bro. You're, you're listening. You have right builds. You're missing some special stuff like CTPs, like all this blessing. But yeah, I totally get it. I was in this place for sure. And yeah. I hope I helped. Let's go to the next one. And the next one is Yam1438007. And yes, let's go through his cards. 
this is a really nice card set here i mean this one is uh, for pvp and this one is kind of low value but in general having fox guardians of the galaxy and uncanny avengers it's uh, you know, a uh, mark of wealth, I could say. They're really nice, uh, nice built it cards here. You got the physical attack proc from this card, yeah. Okay, cool. And max HP, it's really nice. Cooldown 28, it's cool. 30, <laughs> cooldown is cool, yeah. 38, ignore defense, it's quite nice. Uh, but your attack stats, it's even lower. But the 10% pierce gives you the opportunity to have more in your account and that feels cool. Uh, I would go to get some more attack, okay, obviously, but I mean you don't really miss something on your account at the moment as it seems. And let's see the tier 4 you did focus on and there is no one here to sneak peek for us, but yet let's see. Oh, Iron Man. Solid solution, CDB of Rage, really sweet build, okay, our critical rate on your artifact feels cool, Power of Hungry Hulk, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna pretend that I'm not seeing this ISO here, because it's disgusting, having this, this beautiful Tony Stark boy here, and you miss these things, I mean, these things, I mean, how, how much, how much this thing cost, give him some love, give him some love. Hulk with your uniform and CDP of authority doesn't feel a really nice idea. I mean, you need the HP on him, so even a guard break immunity, HP, invisibility proc, obelisk could work better than this because you miss the HP from here and the HP is the fuel for Hulk. Uh, you just want to fill him with HP and he's gonna smash. Uh, with this uniform or the newest, but the newest is the best, of course. And yes, I'm also Groot, feels like not that good. You prefer Protect the Captain, got the best stats for PvP. And this is a really nice guy here. You're almost here for him. He totally deserves it. But bro, you already with level 74 Black Bolt, you can smash literally every world boss legend. You should invest on him more drop him the overdrive, do ISO him and put some Urus and you're gonna see miracles even with a Nobelisk. Don't have him like that. I mean, he is the leader of Inhumans. Leader of Inhumans. Are you getting that? Give him some love. 72 Thor with a judgment feels a world boss killer, but the rest of the game has to be hard for you. Uh, but yeah, a rage could make him sign more. You want to give him some love. I mean, you spend the materials for level 80 him, level 72 him at least, and you don't give him some love here. I saw also you're struggling with this stuff. I mean, if you play the game daily, you can't. And with the newest uniform, she could do something, but with this uniform, she can't do anything pretty much. But yeah, uh, I guess you already know with this. She is one of the best characters to invest on, but yeah, she needs tier 4 to compete with Shuri, to compete with Kamala. So I'm gonna see. Okay, no uniform for Namor. Uh, his new uniform really gives him a lot. And I could give him some love, he totally deserves it. Uh, depends if you have another combat villain, but I guess you don't. Uh, Captain America here with a very old uniform. At least he's a villain and he's a useful striker with that, but yeah. Cool. Uh, let's see the ABX meta. Mighty Judgment on Wanda. Cool. And here artifact. Nice build there. Raid on Doctor Strange is kind of strange because he is going off the meta and you we only use him for GBR now, but I guess you want the GBR clear, okay. Kamala Khan from the other side, you make her a world boss legend killer also, but again no Urus. Why bro? Even if you are capped on everything, you want to give them a physical attack Urus, you want to build the characters. This is bad, this is bad. They are not performing the same that they could do with Urus and Iso. This is nice build here. 
cool. You took uh, the president one, which is really nice. But again, no energy attack Urus. Why, bro? What are you doing with the Urus? Are you putting them down below from the, your bed and sleeping with them? What's, what's that? Where's your Urus? Your attack Urus? Energy or physical attack Urus are missing, bro. Why? Tina also, Doctor Strange thing, she is going off the meta. Yeah, you, you have physical attack Urus, I can see them. It's not like your account is bugged and there is no attack Urus. You have them and you are not equipping them? Why? Okay, he works also with a Nobelisk. Give him some love, give him a Nobelisk. He can be useful for World Boss Legend. From the other side, Battery Bill. Why you keep this? And you have, uh, I. It's Mr. Knight. Okay, you don't have his latest uniform. I get it now. You have dropped the character from your into the, your closet and not playing with him. But believe me, bro, with the Nobelisk 72 and the new uniform, he can do really nice things for you. And uh, really nice choices here on the okay insight. On Valkyr, it's cool, but you don't have an ABX character for combat female, and you're missing Titania also, as it seems. Sea Hulk, yeah, you, you don't have characters here. You want to build Shuri, she is your best, your best, your very best, your very, very <laughs> female ABX, ABL speed types. She's really nice, even with an Obelix, she's working perfect, but with the raids. C signs, uh, Makari, okay, build Makari, okay, you have done your choices, you have some CDPs, you want eventually to focus on something specific, I mean, you're not really good on PvP, because you don't have units for PvP, you have like only Sentry, and you miss all the rest, like Gore, Thanos, uh, there is character that you could build and get some value through them, I'm seeing that you have dropped a lot of epic quests and you don't have opened them uh, but in the same time you have the characters tier 2 to play proper ABX so focus on one game mode or other to get you feel yeah, like you're doing progress you know in your game and if you focus on ABX it's kind of hard to get all the rages I get it but at least for PvP I mean this is your main team here Suri, Spider-Man and uh, Sentry. Let's see your Spider-Man. Brilliant Authority. Okay, he's surviving and he's killing. At least this is cool. This is cool. I hope you enjoy the game. Pierce Reduction here. It's really cool. And yes, I hope I helped you. You want to focus more on the build, on the build of the characters. Urus, Isos, you forget everything. Why? Why, bro? Why? And yes, let's go to the... And the next one feels to be a new player here, as it seems. Uh, he's the last roast I'm gonna do for today. And you can see his cards is really a uh, new player's feels like, you know. Uh, this Loki card is really bad. You don't, you don't deserve to be crafted. Or this one, if you are not planning to focus on PvP. This one, it's the one you need to change first. And at least you got the energy attack proc, that's huge, really nice. Ignore defense and cooldown are really low and I could boost them somehow, like, you know, craft the Guardians of the Galaxy card to get some cooldown or ignore defense by luck, you know. Or focus on equipping something like Loki instead of this one. Uh, because this one gives you cooldown from the one side, from the other side you're missing the all attack. And this card here could give you more stats if you craft it. Uh, of course, you have in the middle this one, crafting it too. Uh, but you were really unlucky getting all resist. Uh, disgusting. Okay, let's see what you're planning to build first. Thor. Thor tier 4 feels really nice. I guess you don't really form a lot of tier 4 materials. Join our Discord server, guys, always. You have to remember, down below in the description is an invitation, always. In our Discord server, you're, we are carrying daily a lot of people for GBR to collect their materials, to build their tier 4s. A lot of people have built their tier 4s completely in my server and with Alaska Light, moderator there, and helping with the carries. 
and basically there is a huge amount of people beware of danger there's a lot a lot of people that contact you julian brahman of the year there's a lot of names sorry for forgetting someone there's more than 10 people daily there contacting each other helping each other with rifts with gbrs you don't need to miss the gbrs we are there we are doing the runs we are inviting people my friend list goes like that i'm kicking people adding people alaska light the same we're going crazy and boosting all of you you can ask for help okay you get cyclops to help your account with uh, a support uh, during this event i guess because he's like naked you did the right choice uh your um your thor is built really nice but you want to focus on build him even more and level 80 him of course a uh, proking obelisk here really nice choice venom from the other side need the raids to process iron man needs his last uniform or the other one this is the worst uniform you could get sorry uh black bolt you have his artifact you have everything you got the right obelisk here of course a rage could work better but yes that's a start and i would focus for second uh tier four uh iron man or black bolt i mean black bolt it's a villain thor is a hero both are universal but still and your your account it's in the very start i would focus for some supports and for pvp yeah this unit and this unit feels the more solid uh but yes you want to focus yeah max hp but guard break immunity also for pvp protect the captain your listener nice uh suri also needs her last uniform yeah your account it's like you just started and as it seems you have done really nice choices here i would go awaken valkyr i would go tier 3 taskmaster to have more supports for my characters and also you need some solid units to dps iron man with the latest uniform and level 80 with just an obelisk is a really good solution and you have already focused on thor which is really nice uh, but you need like someone like Suri with the last uniform. She's a really good DPS and support in the same time. And who else? Who else? Who else? Okay, you have a lot of uh, characters you could go for leadership. Titania is a really nice solution for ABX multiple days. And she's really cheap. And when awakening character that provides you leadership, support buffs for some characters and two to three days. It's three days, it's combat female, it's villain combat, you're getting a lot of value out of here in ABX and ABL. The rest of your account, it's pretty it's just started, so yeah, good luck with the crystals I'm gonna give you. As a new player, you're gonna need them, and I hope I help you focusing on the characters you need to build to go through your gameplay and your experience total uh, with the game better. That was it guys, don't forget to contact me to get you the codes, I'm gonna try to tag you in uh, forum also, uh, yeah, that was it, see you into the next, and don't forget to drop me down below the comments, your IGN and what you bought in Black Friday with, this, with the rest of the things you need to do to participate into the giveaway, bye bye to everyone, kisses.